adventure today? Well, let's do it. Well, howdy guys and gals. Backwaters and backroads here, obviously. So, I've been away for a little while, and it's nice to be back. I hope that you guys are still here. <laughs> I guess I'll find out. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on. You got it. Let's go. Come on. I love that fuel injection. Okay guys, so got off the dock here, or the, the river bank. I'm gonna go find a good place to stop and make a sandwich, I'm hungry. And then we will continue on out into the lake. Yeah, coming up on the bridge in the trussle. I know what you want. I'm telling you guys, there is not much better that I have found in this life so far than being out on the water, going slow on a little houseboat, shanty boat. There's just something about it. It's so relaxing. And I'm not a relaxed person. You can trust me on that. I have a lot of anxiety and I'm always managing it. But after an hour or so out in the water doing five, six, seven miles an hour just looking around, it, it's, just, it's just so calming. If you have the same problem, you might want to give it a try. Shanty boats, I'll tell ya. Alright guys, then we're going to try to do some beaching. Go! Go! <laughs> 10 mile point, that's what I'm calling it. Right, so that's 10 mile. And this bay goes around. Sorry if I'm making you dizzy. Around that corner, 14 mile point lighthouse. And people must not come out here too much because there is a lot of driftwood. A lot of nice stuff. Let's take a look around. Got some rocks to choose from. Let's see if we can find some interesting driftwood. Or some rocks. Now this is a mess of driftwood. I'll just take a brief moment here guys to let you know or tell you why I've been gone for, I don't know, a month and a half maybe. I had some friends visit me for the whole month of July. One of them was from the United Kingdom and the other one was from Detroit. <laughs> but they know each other and uh, and they don't, I mean, it was awesome and I hope they come back next year and keep coming back every summer. But they don't really like doing this, this kind of stuff, you know, adventures, boating, camping, stuff like that. They're more 
uh, video games and go-kart tracks and water slides and you know I took them to Wisconsin Dells country music festival and stuff like that so you know I went along and I did stuff that I normally would never do uh, but you know in the summer especially my heart longs for these deserted beaches and exploring and adventures and stuff like that so you know I just took a break instead of trying to drag them along or what have you so uh, and you know, of course, I've been moving off the beach. It's still, I'm 90% done, but I'm still kind of finishing that up. I've also been sick for a couple weeks. Uh, I don't know what it is, but it's clearing up. But it's been, it's been a heck of a summer. So, um, but I think we're back on track now. And I just hope I haven't lost a bunch of people by being gone. I guess it's a good test. You know, there's a part of me that's like, if you'll, you know, if you got to take a break once in a while for, a few weeks and you come back and half your people are gone it, they weren't what is that like set them free and if they come back they're yours <laughs> so <laughs> so i just hope you guys are stuck around we'll see i guess in the view counts but um we did go past 5,000 subscribers a few weeks ago which was kind of cool and uh a lot of it's the youtube alg algorithm you know you gotta keep feeding it content all the time and and uh you know i who knows i don't know i'm never gonna figure it out entirely but but anyways we're back on and we're gonna do some scooter we're gonna do some scooter adventures this week so as i've mentioned so anyways enough yapping that's where i've been but i'm back and uh let's get on with it <sighs> ah, told you i had been sick <laughs> i put a hobbler on wavy and she doesn't quite realize all she's got to do is just drag a piece of wood and she can keep up with me unless she got a snag let's find out well, what's going on? Look, look, come on. Oh, jeez. Leave it to you. Leave it to the beagle. Leave it to beagle. This might be a good place to point out the new motor that we put on the barge here. Yamaha EFI 60 horse high thrust. And it is a much better fit. That Honda certainly got the job done, and it would have been just fine if that's all I had. But I picked up a pontoon about a year ago with this on it, and I just knew that this was going to be a much better um, motor for this for this boat because the high thrusts are they have you know big old massive lower units, and they so they have more torque for moving around heavier boats like this barge or like a pontoon or something. They're meant more for torque and low end than speed and this one's being EFI I should be able to get a little bit better gas mileage too so so yeah very happy um I did have to cut this chunk out but I kept it and I'm gonna make it removable because once the motors was in the bay there it, it will clear so but we couldn't get the motor into the bay without taking that chunk out and coming at it this way with a cherry picker so you want back on the boat all right. This is unusual. Usually you want off. Ugh. Well, this is what about 15 minutes of looking around came up with for me. I always like the milled wood. There's a little piece of something I can use for something, a block or something. There's another one I can make a little sign out of. I always like these chewed beaver sticks especially when they're bright colored and then I thought this was an interesting shape and I found some and I found some some beach glass this this one obviously is not a piece of beach glass but it's kind of like a half and half I just dropped a piece of beach glass Here. you're not helping why don't you come out and push us off? Why don't you help once in a while? Alright guys. So it's almost 5 o'clock. Sunset tonight is 9.09. .09, and I kind of want to putt back so... 
I turned around. I'm not going to go to the mouth of the sleeping. You guys have seen it. I've seen it. You know, it'll still be there. It's a great place, but I kind of got a late start this morning because I went to church, you know, so I really didn't get out in the water till about noon. So, so we're just going to slowly make our way back. We'll go by the lighthouse again and uh, we'll hug the shoreline. And uh, well, hopefully, you enjoyed it. We've had some really pretty skies today. The cloud cover has been slowly dissipating and there's this these these rolls, you know, there's like the ends of a of a storm. And I think it's really pretty. There might be a really nice sunset tonight. If there is, I will include it at the end of this video. Um, but yeah, I've really been awestruck about the skies today during this little trip up to Sleeping Bay. Let me see if I can show you what I mean. Okay guys, so we're back in the river. We just slipped under the trestle, we're heading towards my river bank. I'm gonna tie up, I'm gonna show you a couple more things and then I think I got enough to make a video for you. So, thanks for watching. <laughs> I'll see you soon. backwards and backwards it's the next day so we're gonna go on a aimlessly wandering adventure for three four days at least might be more I'm meeting up with a fella named mr. Z you'll see him in the comment sections a, a lot he lives three hours from me or so down towards Green Bay and we've been talking about this all summer and we're finally gonna pull it off I'm going to go meet him tonight, and then we're going to go up Door County and Washington Island, hopefully, and we're going to have a little adventure, and I'm going to make some videos for you, so please stay tuned. Also, if you're here and you're not subscribed, it's free. Just push the button. It doesn't cost anything. Um, hit the like button. I never ask people to do that, and it's probably one of the reasons why my channel grows so slowly. So if you enjoy this kind of stuff, just a guy and his dog just doing random low-budget adventures, just hit the subscribe button. It'll help. So, okay. Thanks. Stay tuned.